You know how you can understand your area of expertise in God? Is where the devil targets you the most at, right? So for example, back in the day, I always attracted friends that would backstab me, like literally backstab me, right? And before they would backstab me, they would start adapting my my personality, my laugh. They would do their hair like mine. They would copy my swag, like my interest in music, my persona, like everything. And at the time, I'm not realizing that it's a bad thing. I'm really thinking, oh, we got stuff in common. We locked in. We twin. You know what I'm saying? So I would just let it happen. And then it would come to a situation where they'll steal the dude that I'm talking to. Or they'll backstab me by sleeping with him behind my back and I have to find out. And I'm so hurt and so devastated and blah, 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 blah. As time went on, this happened to me about four or five times. I was like, I don't trust females. I don't want females around me. They just manipulative. Like, I don't know what's up with their energy. Like, I just don't trust females. I can't, I don't like them playing close to me, right? And for years, this was my attitude. I only got one best friend for this exact reason. But what I started to realize was, you got to play chess with the devil. Because the only reason why he would be trying to do this to you is because something in you is meant for women. And he's trying to pervert it so you never go close to women or like women or be involved with women so you can understand your purpose. Something in me is meant for women to hear, to help them heal, to learn how to love. Something in my testimony is going to set some women free. And because he knows that and he knew that from birth, he's trying to pervert any relationship I could have with a woman. Starting from my mom to the friends that I was attracting. And it took me so many years to realize this. And once I did, I was like, ha. Huh. So you find out your area of expertise. When you pay attention to where the devil keep trying to attack you at, whether it be relationships, finances, um, wealth, you know what I'm saying? Emotions. If he keeps trying to attack you in these areas, it's because that is the area that God is going to favor you in and you are going to do great in. And he knows this. So he wants to make you hate it. He wants to mess up every relationship you have with men so you can hate love because you are a lover and you are going to heal with your love. You are going to touch nations with your love. And he knows this. So he's going to try his best to destroy your little heart. Okay. So if this is happening to you, instead of saying, I need to stay away from females or love and men, and I just need to not have no money because every time I get money, I don't know how to, instead of saying that, say, God, I see where you are trying to bless me. And I also see where the devil is trying to destroy me. And I cancel every assignment of the enemy right now over that area. You know what I'm saying? I reject, I renounce any plan, any evil seed planted in that area to destroy my purpose in you. And I thank you, God, for healthy relationships. I thank you, God, for healthy friendships. I thank you, God, for love, strong love, binding love, healing love, prosperous love. I thank you, God, for expanding my territory. Okay? That is how you find out your area of expertise in God is you go to where the enemy is attacking you at. Because nine times out of ten in there... You're going to find you. Be blessed.